हेलो फ्रेंड्स होप यू आर हैविंग अ वंडरफुल टाइम यू मिनिस्ट्री ऑफ फाइनेंस हैड इश्यूड अ पब्लिक कंसल्टेशन डॉक्यूमेंट एंड ऑफ अप्रैल 2022 फॉर द प्रपोज कॉर्पोरेट टैक्स रिजीम इन यूएई व्हिच विल कम इनटू इफेक्ट फ्रॉम जून 2023 इन दिस वीडियो वी विल बी डिस्कसिंग द इंपैक्ट ऑफ कॉर्पोरेट टैक्स ऑन डिफरेंट ट्रांजैक्शंस मेड बाय एंटिटीज रजिस्टर्ड इन यूएई फ्री जोन्स most of the free zones entities have been granted a tax holiday period of 15 to 50 years and as per the consultation document this tax incentive will be honored subject to the fulfillment of certain condition as per the public consultation document corporate tax treatment on transactions of free zone persons needs to be considered based on the type of the transaction let's discuss now different kind of transactions first If a free zone company earns income from transactions with business located outside of the UAE, then there will be zero percent city rate on income earned. There will be a zero percent city rate for trading within the same free zone or with any other free zone. There will be a zero percent city rate on income from regulated financial services directed at foreign markets. Third, if a free zone company as a mainland branch then there will be a 9% city rate on mainland sourced income and 0% city rate on other income fourth if a free zone company receives a passive income such as dividend interest from mainland ue companies then there will be a 0% city rate fifth if a free zone company has a transaction with their mainland company that is a group company then 0% city rate will be applicable to such transaction however payments to free zone entities will not be deductible for a mainland companies sixth a free zone person located in designated zone for vat can benefit from 0% city rate on income from sale of goods to uae mainland businesses that are importer on record for those goods the last one if there are any other transactions between free zone company and ue mainland company which is not covered in above cases then it will disqualify a free zone company from 0% regime in respect of all their incomes further it has been mentioned in the consultation document that free zone entities will also have an irrevocable option to move to the regular tax regime in terms of the compliance requirement and to take the benefit of 0% city rate free zone entities will have to file their annual return with the tax authority and also need to have audited financial statement for the year so considering the various scenarios we have discussed in this video it is very important to free zone businesses to analyze in details the nature of various transactions which they are conducting that is whether outside uae within free zone or within mainland companies etc to understand the potential impact of corporate tax hope this video was useful to get an understanding of taxability of free zone businesses thank you for watching this video